Hello for this new exercise du jour. Today I'm showing you an etude over the G major scale uh, I came up with today. Uh, I'll start by playing it and then we'll explain how it's built so that you can recreate it, move it to different keys and maybe come up with your own variations. One, two, three. <laughs> So that was uh, the whole etude. So the pattern that I'm taking through all the degrees of the major scale uh, is the following. Uh, I'll do it over the first degree so that things are a little bit clearer. So I start, the first note I'm playing is uh, the root of whatever triad uh, I'm playing. So if we're in G major, I'm playing G, so I'm starting by playing a G, G major triad. And what I do is I play one, three, I play the fifth an octave higher than where it's supposed to, than, than where it's was supposed to be. So then I go to the sixth degree, but down the octave. So and then back to the root of that of that, of that same triad. So so it goes like this. And once I'm here, this the root of the first of whatever degree I was playing now becomes the fifth of the new triad. And this is, uh, in this case, it will be C major, and I go down C major like that. So until I go back to uh, my first degree again. So and I repeat that twice. And then I repeat that pattern on all degrees. So for example, if I go one down, one down I'm going to play F diminished, followed by B minor. I'm actually following the cycle of fourth because I'm going through the chord C, uh, G, C, F sharp, B minor, etc. Um, and this exercise uh, is focused on working on big leaps, obviously ex exploring a little uh, wider ranges than what I'm, what I'm personally usually working on, so that I can hear bigger intervals, but it actually all belong to the... When I'm playing that, I'm actually playing from like a, a, I mean except for the A but I'm playing a G6 arpeggio and I'm spreading it out uh, in a I'm spreading it out much more than if I was doing a and then I'm mixing up chords and going through the whole major scale and then you can find really cool applications for some of these phrases for example here if when I start with the fourth degree um, Great phrase you can play over a, a, a two five one A minor. That resolves to G major, for example. And each one on each one of these degrees, you can find um, applications over uh, chords or uh, chord sequence uh, that you're using in tunes. So that was it for today. I hope you'll enjoy this etude, and uh, see you soon. Bye.